Moin Moin und hallo Leute, mein Name ist Fresh G und ich heiße euch herzlich willkommen zu einem weiteren Let's Play. Und wie ihr schon seht und wie ich es auch schon angesprochen hatte, wir spielen heute Life is Strange. Ich habe mir gleich das ganze Paket gekauft, das heißt der Season Pass gibt mir die Möglichkeit euch auf jeden Fall auch bei den weiteren äh, Episoden, die dann rauskommen, noch auf dem Laufenden zu halten, wie die Geschichte weitergeht. Und ich würde mal sagen, genießt es einfach, erwartet keine große Action oder sowas, erwartet eher vielleicht Dramatik und macht euch einen Tee oder sowas, chillt euch vor dem PC, vor euren Fernseher, falls ihr sowas, so ein Smart TV habt oder euer Tablet und entspannt ein bisschen. So surreal. Famously called film Little Pieces of Time. But he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay. I'm These in class. Everything's cool. Room. I am okay. From light to shadow. From color to chiaroscuro. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black? I didn't and white? fall asleep, and that Anybody? sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller. Weird. Diane Arbus. There you go, Victoria. Why Arbus? Because of her images of hopeless faces. Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. Ist doch eigentlich ein schönes Foto. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. She saw humanity as tortured, right? And I frankly, haven't kept up with my journal as much as I should. Keep that to yourself. If anybody else looked at this, what would they think? Okay, das ist ihr Tagebuch. Komischerweise ist alles auf Englisch, obwohl ich mein Steam auf Deutsch habe und das Spiel eigentlich auch deutsche Untertitel haben sollte. Ich habe schon nachgesehen. Leider gibt es bei mir die Option nicht, aber vielleicht ja dann bei den nächsten Episoden. Auf jeden Fall schon mal eine Menge, was hier so steht. Scheint so ein bisschen hipstermäßig drauf zu sein. Und vielleicht ist er ja sogar eine Gamerin, wenn man da unten das Pixelherz sieht. Hier sehen wir, dass wir im Prolog sind. Okay. Seriously though, I could frame any one of you in a dark corner. 
and capture you in a moment of I can't believe I still have this pencil case. I should upgrade to the 21st century. But I Isn't like it old school. Too obvious? What if Arbus chose to capture people at the height of I their do beauty love my analog system? camera. She had I should take a quick picture now. So she could have taken another approach. I have to admit, I'm not a big fan of her work. I prefer... I should take a picture to prove I'm still here. Me too. Plus, it's perfect for my portfolio. And I have to get my daily selfie America. quota. And there was honesty about the economic conditions of the air. But a beauty in the struggle. You, you don't have beauty without a beat. Which explains why Frank was Kerouac's photographic muse. And both were the great cross... I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please Tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits. Ich wusste es oder fragen Sie mich? Naja, ich würde mal sagen, ich wusste es. Das ist in dem Fall die beste Ausrede. I did know, but I kind of forgot. You either know this or not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. <laughs> the Daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's faces, making them extremely popular from the 1800s onward. The first American daguerreotype self-portrait was done by Robert Cornelius. You can find out all about him in your textbook or even online. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Victoria doesn't waste a second kissing ass. Sobald unsere Hausaufgabe dieses Foto, was ich anscheinend auf dem Tisch liegen hatte, gut wird, haben wir eine Chance, zu einem großen Event eingeladen zu werden und das könnte ja, unser Kickstart in die Fotokarriere sein. Das ist das Journal von einem anderen? Even her school books are gift wrapped. <laughs> I can't believe she made fun of me in class. What is she, 15 years old? And people laughed. Of course, Victoria has to have the bestest, newest, most expensive everything. Hm. Die scheint so die typische rich bitch zu sein und na. Irgendwie muss jeder sie immer beachten und sie weiß natürlich auch alles, weil ihre Eltern sie sonst übelst vermöbeln würden. Aber sie hier sieht so aus, als ob sie ein bisschen Probleme hätte. Aber erstmal müssen wir mal gucken, was hier am PC ist. Obviously Blackwell spent bank on the computers here. Looks like somebody was already working on this. Cool. Victorious Tablet möchte ich nicht benutzen. Ich will nicht wissen, was denn hier los ist. Hi Kate. Oh. Hi Max. You seem quiet today. Just thinking too much. I hear that. Wanna go grab a cup of tea and bitch about life? Thanks, but not today. I have to go over homework. No worries. Let's hang later. Sure. 
die sieht ganz schön kaputt aus. Naja, mal gucken. Vielleicht können wir die ja noch näher kennenlernen. Wer weiß, was die für Probleme hat. Hm, das wird eine cool Shirt. Oh, probieren wir es mal. This is ridiculous. I always get so shy and nervous around Mr. Jefferson. Ooh. <lacht> Aber gut, der sieht auch für einen Mann echt sehr fesch aus. Also ziemlich adrett gekleidet. Für einen Lehrer ziemlich modebewusst. Ich glaube, ihr wisst, wovon ich rede. <lacht> Wenn ihr mal so an eure Lehrer denkt oder zurück an eure Lehrer denkt. Die meisten sind ja doch immer etwas schrill oder seltsam gekleidet. Sprechen wir ihn trotzdem mal an. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes, excuse you. No, Victoria, excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Ist das jetzt Sarkasmus oder ist er der Einzige, der mich wirklich richtig leiden kann? Hm. Also auf jeden Fall hatte ich die Zeit, deswegen möchte ich an der Stelle nicht wirklich lügen. Do I have to? I just don't think it's that big a deal. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. Now I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you, but life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah blah blah, right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now All you need is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. Hm. Aber jemand kann trotzdem ein großer Künstler sein und trotzdem alles so für sich behalten. Nur es wird niemand wissen, dass er ein Künstler ist. Every time I look at Victoria, I feel like she's talking smack about me. Oh ja, das kenne ich auch. Was sind wir hier? Even in pictures, the forest around here always looks mysterious. You can never escape the lighthouse here. Hm. Von dem haben wir ja geträumt, nur das Haus war irgendwie nicht an der Stelle. Was rechts daneben ist. Aber ein Leuchtturm ist ja aus, auf jeden Fall aus äh, Alan Wake schon ein Begriff. Hier ist eine Kamera. Wow, Mr. Jefferson is not messing around with that monster. He probably paid 20 grand for that camera. I bet he gets pristine digital images. But I still dig my little instant camera. Ja, da kann ich auf jeden Fall mitgehen. Ich bin ja auch ein ziemlich großer... Kameranerd, was jetzt Bewegtbild sowie Standbilder angeht. Man, he even has the best Plasma HDTV for a class monitor. Can't wait to watch some more documentaries on this bad boy. Aber wie sie schon gesagt hatte, leider ist das ganze Hobby nicht wirklich billig. So cool that we can check these out anytime. The decisive moment by Henry Cartier-Bresson, that's rare. Any leap of it's mad respect. The amazing Eugene Smith. Good to see Avedon among the masters. Dolly, of course. Lots of people I haven't heard of yet. I guess that's why I'm here. Und ich glaube, ich habe von keinem einzigen von dem was gehört. <lacht> oh man. Also der Charakter scheint bis jetzt so ziemlich schräg zu sein. Nicht gerade sehr selbstbewusst. Und weiß anscheinend auch noch nicht so wirklich, wo er hin soll. Und hier ist der Fotokontest. Hier ist der Poster für den Contest. Mr. Jefferson really expects me to enter. Why? I don't know if I'm ready for my 15 minutes of infamy. Are you an everyday hero? Find out, enter to win. 
Everyday Heroes Photo Contest. Submit an image that best uh, represents yourself or others in heroic situations. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Actions. Okay. Um, ich würde mal sagen, wir haben alles hier im Klassenraum uns angesehen. How cute I looked yet. I was about to. I'm not paying a hundred. Welcome to the real world. Just cute. Hot. Then I might send you a special picture to class. I feel like you have to Because Max wants everybody to see how hip she is. And she plays it so sharp. I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like a total loser. I hate that class. It's so fucking boring. She's so fucking shy. She takes selfies with a giant camera. In a world without you American girls I'd like to Be part of the world around you Driving a car by the seaside Watching the world from the bright side Empty, good. Nobody can see my meltdown, except for me. Die Kleine scheint es nicht so wirklich mit Selbstbewusstsein zu haben. Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. Fuck it. When a door closes, a window opens. Or something like that. Okay, girl, you don't get a photo op like this every day. It's cool, Nathan. <laughs> Don't stress. You, you're okay, bro. Just count to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. <laughs> you're the boss. So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch! I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down! Don't ever tell me what to do! I'm so sick of people trying to control me! You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs! Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! Whoa! What the fuck? How? How can that be? I was in the bathroom. He shot that poor girl. I held up my hand. 
And then I was back here. Yes, he likely was. These pieces of time can frame us. I already heard this lecture. From light to shadow. From color. Now Kate is being hassled again. And if Victoria's phone rings, this is real. Now, Shit. Can you give me an example of a Man, photographer I cannot who believe this. captured the human condition in black and white? Okay, if I'm crazy, Anybody? I might as well go all the way. Bueller. Diane. Can I actually reverse time? Go, Victoria. Why Arbus? Because. Can you I actually did it. A photographer who perfectly I'm captured a human the human time machine. In black and white. Anybody? Max, Bueller? don't Diane. freak out. Not yet. There you go, Victoria. Why Arbus? Because of her Keep it together, of Max. Faces. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers. When and I took my selfie, Jefferson asked me a question. Tortured, right? If he does exactly again, I'll know this is for real. Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though. I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. And shh, shh, I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie, a dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. I know I'm not of dreaming course, this. As you all know, the it's real. Portrait has been popular I can since tell. The early 1800s. Your generation so I can go back in time. For selfie expression. What if that girl so, isn't dead yet? I couldn't resist. The point Can I save that her? The portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography. For I need to go to the bathroom quickly and check it out. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? I feel me not so good, and I must mal unbedingt das Bad benutzen. Ich würde mal sagen, jetzt auf krank zu tun. Kommt ein bisschen komisch rüber. I'm sorry, but I really have to use the bathroom. Nice try, Max. But you're not gonna get away that easy. We can talk more after class. Is there anybody oh, here shit. who knows their stuff? Jefferson wants to keep me you after class. And I need time to save that girl. Types? A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. What if I rewind the again process, and give him the right answer? Out fine detail in people's faces, making. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Hm, und jetzt haben wir die Antwort. The Daguerrean process, invented by a French painter named Louis Daguerre around 1830. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. Nice work, Max. <sighs> the Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular, mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. But you can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Max is so far way ahead of everyone. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Max, you are not crazy. You are not dreaming. It's time to be an Everyday Hero. Yes. Victoria, you still have to do your homework this week. Even if you're submitting your photo for the competition, everybody in class is turning in a photo. So, you see the dilemma? I know, Mr. Jefferson. I just worked so hard in the shot, and I'm I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. I'm not avoiding, just... Biding time? Waiting for the elusive right moment? Exactly. Max, don't wait too long. 
John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Go on now. Don't let me stop you. Okay, jetzt kann ich das, was ich gerade eben gemacht habe, wieder rückgängig machen. Mit LB. Even if you're submitting your photo for the competition, everybody in class is turning in a photo, so you see the dilemma? I know, Mr. Jefferson. I just worked so hard in the shot, and I'm sure you know what it's like to be consumed Ach, by your work. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes, excuse you. No, Victoria, excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. I'm on top of it. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Max, you're on fire today. All the right answers, good. Make sure you finish working on it by today. I have faith in you. Hm. Also er ist, wenn man es mal mit der Sprache von dem Spiel ausdrücken möchte, für uns bis jetzt der einzige Leuchtturm. Mal schauen, was wir retten können. I hope I have enough time to get to the bathroom. Please, please. I can't tell anybody. They'll think I'm crazy. Yo, Daniel, you tease me. You know I don't tease. I hate that science class. Okay, Max, retrace every step. I washed my face. I shredded my photo. Then the... Butterfly flew in, and I took a photo. Leave them out of this bitch! I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself! You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with! Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Don't Come on, put that thing down! Tell me what to do! Wow. I'm so I need sad. a hammer to break it open! Control me! You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs! Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! Oh. Holy shit, I can't let this happen! No. If I can reverse time no, no, again, no, no, I can no, help no. her. Get in hella more trouble for Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? No way. Don't ever touch me again, freak. <laughs> Another shitty day. That did not happen. This cannot be real. I just saw a girl get shot and then saved her. What the fuck is going on? Do not freak out. Okay. Aber wir müssen unser Foto mitnehmen. Sonst ist auf jeden Fall hier an dem Tatort noch ein Hinweis. Aber so wie ich das sehe, kann ich da leider nichts machen. Hey, do you hear that fire alarm? That means you should be outside. I had to use the bathroom. Girls always use that excuse. Excuse for what? For whatever you're up to. Your face is covered in guilt. The alarm tripped me out. Then trip on out of here, Missy. Or are you hiding something? Huh? Thank you, Mr. Madsen. The situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Caulfield alone and please turn off that alarm since that's your job. Ich würde mal sagen, in your face mit dem Spruch. You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm... I'm just a little worried about my future. 
Are you sweating pinballs? Is that all you're thinking about? You can always be up front with me, Max. Or have you done something wrong? Is that it? Well, Max, talk to me. Und jetzt haben wir ein riesengroßes Problem. Ich persönlich bin eigentlich keine Petze. Aber jemanden mit einer Waffe zu bedrohen, das hat nichts mehr mit Petzen zu tun, wenn man sowas weitergibt. Das ist zum Schutz von allen Schülern aus meiner Sicht. Das ist echt kein Spaß mehr. I just saw Nathan Prescott waving a gun around in the girls room. Nathan Prescott. You sure? Yes, he was in the bathroom talking to himself with a gun. I saw everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now you saw this without him seeing you. I was hiding behind a stall. I have the right to be there. It's the girl's room. I know, I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Mr. Prescott happens to be from the town's most distinguished family and one of Blackwell's most honored students. So it's hard for me to see him brandishing a weapon in the girl's bathroom. So what happened next? Then, then he left. I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you going to bust him? This is a serious charge. I'll look into the matter personally. Thank you for bringing it to my attention. That's it? After what I told we'll you? We'll continue this discussion later in my office. Please go outside with the rest of your class now, Miss Caulfield. Of course this academic drone won't do anything since the Prescott family owns Blackwell now. Should I rewind and change my story? Hm. Also wie es aussieht, können wir jetzt noch mal entscheiden, ob wir unsere Tat umkehren, ob wir unsere Meinung ändern. Aber das kann ich mir nicht vorstellen. Rachel Amber. She looks so hopeful and pretty. I wonder what happened to her. Field. Da, da ist das Sportfeld. Und hier ist eine Ausstellung. Oh. Wir haben eine Nachricht. For coffee after school, I need an excuse to not study. Please make sure you check out Nick Romantic on my flash drive. Hey, Mad Max, let's bust shit up. Wait, I have to study for a physics test. So if okay, blah blah blah. Unsere Aufgabe ist es jetzt also. uns mit dem Typen zu treffen, wie es aussieht. Oh. Hier ist unser Dad. 
Und wir sind anscheinend schon ein bisschen mit der Kate befreundet. Okay. Also wir sind 18 geworden. Wahrscheinlich ist das der Grund, warum wir hier studieren. Fotografie lernen. Und unsere Eltern haben uns auch ein bisschen Geld gegeben. Und unser Vater hofft nur, dass wir das nicht alles auf einmal ausgeben. Hey Max, you're around. Always you okay. Did you want to get tea later today? Absolutely. I'll be free after four. Okay, ich weiß nicht, was TTYL bedeutet. <lacht> da bin ich echt nicht drin. Okay, I better get to my dorm and grab that flash drive. Okay, also bevor wir uns mit dem Typen treffen, müssen wir zu unserem Zimmer gehen. That's so cool that Blackwell is doing a show of Mr. Jefferson's work. Okay, unser Lehrer stellt hier also schon seine Sachen aus. Gucken wir uns mal an, was da drüben steht. Mr. Jefferson has such a gift for different styles. Okay, unser Charakter fliegt auf jeden Fall eindeutig auf den Lehrer. Irgendwelche Bilder, wo was Kriminelles passiert. 